It came from two documentary film producers, news producers, one of them from born in Belgium, one of them born in um, Lebanon. Uh, they had done one quite well-known documentary called Prison Lullabies about um, women in the Bedford Correctional Institute who were pregnant and who had their children in prison. Um, and they've also done TV uh, news production, and they've just been involved in the idea of producing for a long time. They were both admirers of this French book show called Apostrophe, Apostrophes, with Bernard Pilot. Uh, I make it believe I knew of it, uh, but I didn't until they told me about it, although it turns out a lot of people have. And they thought, why not do it, try and do it in the United States, and why not try and do it online? And they came to me last summer and asked me if I would be interested in helping them put the show together, and then they asked me if I would be on camera, and I said yes, and there you are. And is it a, gonna be like, Two minutes long goes on YouTube. No, it's going to be somewhere between fifteen minutes and an hour. There are usually four writers on. The first lineup is Richard Price, Scott Simon, I hope, uh, Susan Choi, and Charles Bach, the guy who's written this yeah. first novel, Beautiful Children. Um, and they sit around the table. We sit in a set with like four or five cameras, completely terrifying. And in fact. I was telling that beforehand, and if I stared at him a lot, it's because I was ordered to maintain eye contact. <laughs> yeah, you know, that's intense. It's very hard. It makes me so, feel like talking a lot. Why are you staring at me? I know. So now I'm going to stare at you guys. Um, because I, I do tend to look down. And now I'm not going to do it anymore. Anyway, I talked to each, as it stands right now, I'm thinking of a five to eight minute talk with each writer individually and then opening it up to a general discussion, if I could make that work, and um, having a kind of center of the show, the first show, uh, the first program involves novelists who've written about murder, basically, um, or in the case of Bach, at least, a child's disappearance, it's very gritty stuff. Scott Simon's book is about Chicago, Charles Bach's book is about Las Vegas, Richard Price's book is about the Lower East Side of New York, and Susan Choi's book is about a small bit of Western University, but about a professor who was killed by a terrorist bomb. So we felt there was a coherence there, and that's why we put them together. Second program is going to be all first-time writers, including Matt Clamp's sister, Julie Clamp. All right. And will you have a person whose specific job on the staff is to tell you what the books are about? No, I'm actually reading them at this point. Thank you very much. I'm reading them, but I just said, I mean, with people who may be, ah, uh, this is too boring. Um, no, I'm reading them. And um, I do have a young assistant named John Williams, who is an editorial assistant at uh, Harvard Collins, who recently left, and he's terrific. And he's, yeah, I'm having help filtering, but I will not talk to a writer whose book I haven't read. <laughs>